are closed and schools are still adjusting to distance learning with a lot of kids out of the classroom. And parents, we know that you're adjusting too, doing the same thing at my house. Well, this week, Pflugerville ISD started sending out learning materials for students online. The district also filled up these newspaper boxes with paper copies of assignments. Pretty creative to make sure that your family gets one, especially if you have a family that doesn't have stable internet access or device. You can find those at the same places you would pick up those free lunch meals. But the schoolwork isn't the only thing that kids maybe are missing, if they are missing it. Maybe they're missing something else. Chris Davis joins us now because, Chris, the district is also encouraging what they call virtual spirit weeks. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, so just like uh, a normal spirit week that you would get in person, the individual schools are posting themes for each day on social media. Then they're asking parents and students to take photos of themselves participating in those spirit days and post them along uh, in those threads on social media. And the goal here is to prevent the community from being lost. You can replace the classrooms. We've been really um, structured in that we really expect them to be ready to learn at 9 a.m. Alisa Molina converted her home into home school for her five kids. Three of them go to Wheeland Elementary. It's the people that they miss the most, so that's really hard to, to replace. She turned to Wheeland's Facebook page. Each morning the last two weeks, a new spirit day. They've done hat day, sports day, animal day, learning new things day. And they do feel more connected to the people that they see every day. I haven't heard anything but positives at, at this point. Principal Jared Stevenson is participating too. So are some teachers. They wanted to make sure kids still feel that they're part of a community. It's really uh, a lot simpler when we're on campus, when kids come in in the mornings uh, and you can greet them with a high five or you know, a fist bump and say hi and check in with them. It does bring a sense of that intangible togetherness. Elisa's kids need that away from friends and teachers, especially as this first week of distance learning winds down with at least four to go. I'll look forward to August next year. If we don't get to go back, I think it'll be like we will all have a renewed sense of teachers are amazing. Chris Davis, KXAN News. Yeah, certainly a lot of parents going to be feeling that about teachers over the next couple weeks, I'm sure. Now, Wheeland Elementary is just one example. Other schools within Pflugerville ISD are doing this as well. Today at Wheeland is Science Day. Tomorrow, to round out the week, is Creative Arts Day. Certainly going to be some interesting pictures, I'm sure, coming out of these last two days. We'll send it back to you.